Hi guys, this is Mario from Dollcore Studio. In this episode, we will see how Nine Slice works. It's very simple and super useful for 2D platformer and other 2D type games. So, here we have one tile sliced into nine parts marked with letters. Corners A, C, G and I will not change in size. Sections B, H will stretch or tile horizontally. Sections D and F will stretch or tile vertically. And middle section E will stretch or tile horizontally and vertically. Let's see that in practice. In Unity, select a sprite and for mesh type, choose full rect. Apply changes and that will lead you to sprite editor. Now use green lines to slice sprite into nine parts. Click apply and exit sprite editor. Now let's add a sprite. In a sprite renderer, we can choose draw mode between simple, sliced and tiled. Simple mode is sprite default mode and we don't want that behavior. We need sliced or tiled. Let's set draw mode to sliced. Now if we resize our sprites, corners will stay the same size, sides and middle part will stretch in the right way, as you can see. Great. If we set draw mode to tiled, our middle part will tile, that means it will repeat itself. We can choose between two tile modes, continuous and adaptive. You can see behavior of continuous mode, middle part will repeat freely. In adaptive mode, repeating sections will repeat only when dimensions of the sprite reach stretch value. You can adjust a value between 0 and 1. For example, if value is 1, the sections will repeat when sprite is stretched to twice its original size. Another example of 9 slices are letters. Again, same procedure. Just choose tile mode you want. You can see effect of continuous and adaptive mode. Last thing, when using nice slice, you don't want to edit colliders manually. So, let's add box collider 2D to our sprite. In Collider Settings, check out the Tiling box. That will automatically fit your collider. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.